hi guys it's kuku here and welcome back to my channel if you are new don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell in today's video we're making an oxtail stew if you want to see how i prepared this mouth watering stew stay tuned okay guys for the ingredients you need something like 1.2 kilograms of oxtail some beef stock two carrots spring onion a lemon thyme and a rosemary two cloves of garlic chopped pepper some flour chopped onions tomato paste a can of diced tomatoes vegetable sauce butter beans grated ginger salt and pepper and some olive oil I'll list all the measurements for the ingredients in the description down below. So right here guys, I'm giving my oxtail a good wash. I'm using the lemons, you can use limes or vinegar, it's all up to you. And then I'm gonna go ahead and trim all the fat as much as I can so that my gravy won't be too oily. And I'll leave my oxtail soaking in this lemony water for 5 minutes because the acidity from the lemons is gonna help tenderize my oxtail. is still tenderizing in my lemon water I'm gonna go ahead and prepare all my veggies so right here guys I've got my oxtail that I've rinsed I'm gonna go ahead and add in my green onions rosemary my thyme ginger and garlic some salt and pepper and then a good amount of uh, vegetable sauce about three to five tablespoons and then thoroughly mix everything together and make sure all your oxtails are nicely coated and then marinate for 4 hours. So once my oxtail is fully marinated, I'm gonna shake off my marinade for my oxtail and then lightly toss my oxtails in my flour and then I'll start the browning process. guys feel free to use any flour that's available and the reason why I'm tossing my oxtail in my flour is because I want my gravy to be nice and thick In a large casserole over medium heat, add 1 tablespoon of oil and add in your oxtail and allow each side of the meat to brown for 1 to 2 minutes. And uh, guys, repeat the same process on your second batch. same casserole add in your onions and saute for three minutes and then you add back your oxtail toss everything together and then add in your diced tomatoes for my diced tomatoes i used the ones from the can and right here i'm adding all the marinade that was left over when i was marinating my oxtail and then mix everything together thoroughly I'm adding in my beef stock is about 300 mils and mix everything and let it simmer for three minutes and then I'm gonna be adding in my water that's enough to cover my meat and let it cook on low 
cook it for something like three to five hours. So during the last 15 minutes of your cooking process, add in your carrots, your drained butter beans and some tomato paste and give it a good mix and let it simmer for 15 minutes. is too thin you can thicken it up by taking one tablespoon of cornstarch and dilute with two tablespoons of water and then let it simmer for three minutes so here my oxtail is ready nice and tender and the meat is falling off the bone I cannot wait to dish up and dig in I'll be serving mine over some white rice you can choose whatever you prefer you can choose maybe mesh or pop it's all up to you So there you have it guys, my Jamaican mouth watering oxtail stew. I cannot wait to dig in because this looks so inviting and the aroma from my kitchen is so amazing. So let me know guys on the comment section once you try this recipe out and please don't forget to like and share and subscribe if you haven't and thank you guys for watching. Stay safe. Bye.